What is up, everybody? Um, my eyes are watering today. The AC is blowing in the truck. I hope y'all can hear me. Um, I haven't been on here in a while as far as dropping videos and making videos. Kind of changing my approach and my content. I know lots of y'all love my roast videos, and I get it. I, I enjoy doing it. Um, but here in the next month or so, I should be launching my brand, which is Trap Tunes, THC, The Hunt Club, The Hustlers Collection, Trailer Home Cartel. But, you know, being that I am launching a brand, and it's actually my first brand besides myself, because I consider myself a brand too, but <clears throat> my first actual merch brand and just brand, period. I just decided that doing the roast videos wasn't going to be, was not going to be a good look for the brand. Um, I do, I am going to do comedy skits and daily vlogs and art vlogs, showing my artwork and just different stuff that I got going on. Uh, positivity, man, pushing positivity right now is really what I'm on. And that being said, um, I got some weird dude named Carl. God bless his heart. Um, he's trying to drag me into something that has absolutely nothing to do with me. Because I told him he should just mind his business. And I think a lot of people right now should just mind their business. And stay in their own lane and do their own thing. And... Um, but it's, it, it, it's becoming that YouTube is a cesspool of bullshit. Like, literally, it's just bullshit. Like, this guy Carl is questioning my Christianity and saying I'm not a Christian and saying I'm a bad, bad person and I'm this and I'm that. Dude, you don't even know me. You don't know me. You've never met me. I can honestly say 98% of people on YouTube have never met me. They don't know me. Um, that being said, me as a person, as a grown-ass man, I can't judge somebody that I don't know. You know what I'm saying? Like, I can't, I can't sit and say this person is this and this person is that if I don't know that person. Um, the guy seems to need some seriously mental health, and now he has a tag team partner some chick that's just about as loopy as he is. They 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 have a, a, a the tag team championship belts because they're freaking WWE characters to me. I don't want to get on here and drag this guy. Like, say what you want about me, but when you question somebody's Christianity, it's just not. It's just not Christian like. It's just. It's just not. Who am I to say? Who am I to judge you and your faith and your belief in God? It's just, it's just, it's an oxymoron. It's like ass backwards as hell. Like, I just don't understand. And I do understand because YouTube and social media has literally just screwed up, screwed everything. Like, it's, it's so weird now. Like, I don't even feel like getting on here and posting anything or even being sociable on this social app because it's just it's, it's ridiculous the stuff that I see on a daily basis the bickering and the fighting are over absolutely nothing like you people are fighting over nothing you're downgrading each other and, and the crazy thing is a lot of you dudes are good dudes like you can genuinely tell that you're good dudes but you're too caught up in another man's life y'all are all caught up in each other's lives and trying to drag somebody that you don't see the good in people. It's just totally turned me off, y'all. And I know I have a lot of supporters that really rock with me, and I, I love y'all to death, but it's turned me off so bad. I don't even want to log in no more. I don't even want to look at it. It's, 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 it's sad, man. The stuff you guys are like, you, all you guys are grown ass men. All you guys are 35 and up. And out here arguing on a between the screen, on a phone, on your computer. Like all of y'all just look 
like little children, bro. You're judging this one and this one and that one and doing it. And it's like, really? Like, for what? What do you get out of that? Like, that's another reason why I'm not doing the roast videos no more. Because, bro, I don't want to be known. I don't want my kids to grow up and say, look at my dad. He was an asshole. So this guy didn't have no teeth. You know what I'm saying? Like, I'm just not, I'm not on that no more. And I have every right not to be on that. I'm going a whole new direction with my life. Um, I'm not perfect by any means, but I'm striving to be more perfect. More, uh, perfect is not the word, just, just a better person. I'm striving every day to be a better person. Part of me being a better person was letting go of some things that I needed to let go of. YouTube don't make me no money. I have almost 20,000 subs. I'm not even monetized. I don't want to be monetized. I don't want to make money off of YouTube. I don't I don't approach this platform like that. I just do this for fun, man. And now that I've built somewhat of a following, I'm going to use it to put my artwork out and to hopefully have people rock my t-shirts, rock my stickers, and rock my canvases on their walls and their studios or their apartments or you know, just do something fun and something that I love to do. Like, I love art. I love cartoony. Like, that's my thing. Like, I'm not no, like, uh, like some crazy artist like that. I just do cool stuff. Like, I like the stuff I do. You know, and every, every piece of, every trap tune I do is just a little bit of me and my personality. <laughs> and I enjoy doing it. And if I can take care, help take care of the family, by doing that, why not do it? You know, I was blessed with an opportunity. I've really been trying to get this stuff together. It took a little bit longer than I wanted it to take, which is fine. It's cool. I'm, I'm patient. I, I know next month's probably my month. I feel like next month will be it. We'll be launching next month sometime. And that's cool. That's fine. And plus, it gives me more time to get my end of, the, my end of things together. And it's a lot to get together when you want to do something and you want to do it right. I'm working with some great people. I can't wait to get started on this new journey of life. But then I got these just brain dead people trying to wrap me up in something that has nothing, absolutely nothing to do with me. I don't understand. And then I'm a scumbag and I'm this and I'm that. And like, you don't even know me, dude. You don't know me. So I've kind of reached a point where it's like, keep talking about me. I'm just going to contact my lawyer and have them just cease and desist anything about me. I'm just tired of people talking about me. Um, if you're not talking positive about me, don't talk about me at all. If you ain't got nothing nice to say, don't say nothing at all. Your, your, your parents should have told you that. And that goes for other people beefing and arguing amongst each other. If y'all ain't got nothing nice to say about nobody, I wouldn't say nothing at all. I just don't understand this whole this whole YouTube thing, man. This, this man to me, YouTube is meant to entertain people, laugh, have fun, cut up. But y'all take this stuff way too far, and ain't nothing entertaining about a bunch of grown ass men arguing like some schoolgirls, like some drama schoolgirls. But yeah, I just wanted to tap in with y'all, man, and let y'all know. Watch out for the crazies because the crazies are out here and they have nothing better to do with their life because they have nothing going on in their life. They absolutely have nothing going on but sitting on YouTube and trying to jump in other people's business and drain other people's energy and be a negative thorn in other people's asses. And it's just, it's to the point where it's, it's cringy to watch this shit. And I just wanted to voice my opinion on a, on a lot of things. And just let y'all know, man. Y'all know who, anybody that really rocks with me knows who I am. Knows what I stand for, my morals, my principles. And who I am as a person and how I'm growing to become a better man. And that's what I preach around here. Is like, hey man, you might not be perfect, but try to be perfect. You know, like try to grow try to prosper, try to do good shit, you know, there's nothing wrong with doing good shit, 
And there's nothing wrong with disagreeing with somebody, but you don't have to fucking slander their name and drag them through the mud. You don't have to do that. I mean, that's just a sign of weakness to me. But, yeah, man, I'm uh, I'm actually on my way to Lowe's. I mean, Home Depot. I like Lowe's better, but I'm going to Home Depot. Um, I'm like, I gotta stain my patio and my other fence and building a new fence, laying some concrete next month, getting a jacuzzi, did new kitchen cabinets, remodeling my kitchen, doing floors, trying to uh, paint, drywall, just doing all kinds of stuff to the house this summer, I'm trying to remodel my house. I don't know if we're going to stay or we're going to go or we're going to move, I don't know. Um, I'm just blessed, man. I, I've been extremely blessed in my life, man. I'm I went through some hard shit to get to where I'm at now. I totally get it, man. I'm super blessed. And I really believe God will continue to bless me if I continue to do the right thing. That's what I'm on right now. Not perfect by any means, man. I, 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 I fall short sometimes too, but I'm just trying, man. And that's all you can do is, you know, put, up, put, put forth the effort to, to become a better person. And that's what I'm on, man. That's where my life has brought me. I'm 42 years old. I have no time to argue and bicker with people online. Say what you want about me. I truly, truly, really don't give a fuck. Because my kids know who I am. My old lady knows who I am. My family knows who I am. My little bit of friends that I have know who I am. And that's all that matters to me, man. All this other shit y'all got going on is... Uh, the other shit. It's just shit. And I don't have time for it. I don't have the energy for it. There's so much other stuff y'all can be doing with your time. But unfortunately, it's not going to happen because you got people that just ain't got shit to do and just like to stir the pot up. But leave me out of the dumb shit. You know, it ain't got nothing to do with me. I don't care. I just don't care. I cry. Oh my God. I'm hurt so bad because Carl... The weird old Carl thinks that I'm the devil. But buddy, I'm not the devil. I'm so far from the devil. But yeah, good luck Carl and your tag team partner. Uh, I wish y'all the best on y'all's journey to tear somebody down that you don't even know. Have fun with that. Positive vibes only over here, y'all. Miss me with the dumb shit. I love y'all. I'll tap back in with y'all sometime soon. Trap Tunes coming soon. I can't wait. I, I know y'all are going to support me. I just know it. I just know it. I know I got support out there. I know y'all are going to show me plenty of love. And I can't wait. I just can't wait for y'all to see what I got on my sleeve. I, I've showed a lot of it, but it's going to be dope. It's going to come. And we, we're going to, yeah, building a brand, man. I love y'all, man. Y'all stay safe. Y'all stay blessed. Just ignore the negativity. Block it out. Don't watch it. Don't support it. It's not worth it. Find something better to do with yourself. So much, so much good stuff in this world. You just have to search for it and find it. I love y'all. I'm out.